Hey gang, this is Stormy. Thank you guys so much for joining me back here in Kaizo Caverns. And we're about to go into the Spine Forest. And this is a map made by Vex that we're playing in version 1.4. Oh my god, that just gave me the creeps from hell. That scared me. Oh my god, that creeped the crap out of me. Oh my goodness, I don't believe how much that scared me. Wow. Wow, talk about just heebie-jeebies. Huh. <laughs> I'm not even pretending, you guys. That creeper face looking in at me, just like, <laughs> Oh my god, what the hell? You guys aren't nearly as scary. That creeper head looking in that square right there, though. Wow! Mm. All right. Apparently, I am in the mood to be scared this episode, so this should be fun. We're going into a place called Spine Forest, complete with the uh, creepy cave sounds. Thank you so much, Minecraft, for uh, obliging. So if you'll recall, at the end of the last episode, I decided we needed night vision potions just, uh, well, because we're in version 1.4 and water is so hard to see in version 1.4. So I made some night, night vision potions. Did I say fire resist or night vision? Well, you know what I meant, but uh, I have a horrible feeling I said fire resist instead of night vision. Anyway... The, the stuff that lets you see in the dark? Yeah. Whoops. Um, I see a chest over there. I see bad guys right there. Whoa. I think I'm using a Smite 4 sword. It has knockback 2. Uh, it was a level 30 enchant. So, not real fond of the Smite. Uh, but that knockback is pretty much all I really need. Uh, against creepers, um, especially in a level like this. It looks like this level is really uh, uneven. Mm. I've got him closing in on me from both sides. I wasn't sure what to do there. I was like, ah! They were like equidistant. Don't blow up the chest, please. Don't blow up the chest. Don't blow up the chest. Wow, how did they not blow up the chest? A uh, metal helmet, I'll take that. Um, there was some other stuff in there. Do I have an axe? Yes, I have an axe. Good, yay, I have an axe. I'll just do that because I don't... Uh, I don't want to sit there and sort through it. I want to go over there to that to the light-colored band. Oh, you were underneath that shelf. Is there a creeper fountain over there? I bet there's a creeper fountain over there. Because if you were up underneath that shelf, taking suffocation damage. What blocks are those? Is that that's sand? Yeah, that's sand. Maybe not. Huh, I don't know. Ah, uh, it's still flashing though. And it occurred to me actually after I said that, that the night vision potion wouldn't do anything for that flashing. That's the uh, uh, void fog going in and out. So... Night vision won't do anything for that, but whatever. I can't do anything about it. Although I kind of wish... I'm playing um, Spellbound Caves. I've mentioned it. And I'm playing that in version 1.7 Optifine. Um, because I have Optifine for version 1.7. I figured why not play Spellbound Caves in that version. I, uh, I think maybe when I record these old maps like this, I might... Get the Optifine, try to find the Optifine version for that map version. Because it would be really handy to uh, be able to record with Optifine, actually. Do I feel brave? I don't see a good way to get over there. Um, I'm going to throw away some of this stuff I don't care about. I don't need. I don't care about that. I don't care about a single cookie. I don't care about a hoe. Okay. Um, okay, how many bad guys are over here? They're all going to come bum rush me. Not too many. Okay. Okay, that wasn't too scary then. Did I get that chest? Yeah, I did. Well, I mean, I looked in it. There was nothing in there I cared about, I think. 
What are you? Enchanted leather arm. Really? Okay, so I mean, this level isn't all that dangerous, but still, it's on a ledge. It's kind of hard to get to. I would have expected something a little more interesting than enchanted leather armor, but thank you. It's appreciated. Creepers are not appreciated. Creepers are not, especially because, oh my god, you're, you're, you guys. Legit scared me. You guys, I screwed that jump completely. Couldn't hit him. Um. Do you guys see all these damn chests out on these spines out in the water? Ah, ha, ha. I just saw a chest underwater. Glad we have night vision. Because I don't know. Is there, there might be a light cue or something. He was carrying a, s oh, a, oh, I, oh my god, that is, what? The skeleton was carrying a sword. Which means there was a skeleton that didn't have a bow. Or dropped his bow and picked up the sword? Really? Did I know that could happen? That is, I, I, did, really? I am like, now I'm so confused. Like, uh, yeah, I honestly, I would like to get to this chest, actually. It's what I'm trying to do, but I don't want to come back up and surface into a creeper. They don't like it when you do that. They get pissy. So, is there glowstone or anything around here that would indicate? Um... It's all right. I saw that arrow. I felt that one. Stop it. You can't shoot for shit down in the water. Nothing real exciting in that chest, but eh, it's a nice thought. I'm still befuddled over that skeleton. Whoa, shit. Ah, damn it. I hate it when it does that. Like my computer just randomly decide randomly decides I need to have a different active window and uh <laughs> ah! What just hit me into the Oh my god, there's a lot of bad guys around here. Um I'm not feeling too secure suddenly. Like I'm a little bit nervous all of a sudden. I'd 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 like a defensible space. There's sand above me. Is that where Ooh. Nope. There's sand up there. Is that sand? Do I know about that sand? Have I seen that sand from a different angle? I don't know. Deedle dee dee ding. It was so musical. Ouch, that was not. Seriously? Stop. I'm so over you skeletons always be shooting me, be annoying, be a pain in my butt, tops. Man, our inventory is full and we've like barely even started getting- There's another chest underwater! Holy crap, this place has a lot of loot! Wow! Not that I'm complaining, but holy crap, okay. Wait, why were you up there? Is there something up there? I can't figure out if there are spawners in here or if these are just natural spawns. They're so diverse. Like, there's not an overwhelming number of anything. So I kind of feel like they're natural spawns. Um, they're not an overwhelming number, so if it was a fun box, there would be more of this selection. And this diversity. Uh, whereas if they're natural spawns, I expect lower numbers of all different kinds. If it's a fun box, I expect higher numbers of all different kinds. Basically. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and drink this. We're going to have to leave here anyway. Like, I can't. I'm going to have to leave here. Dude, he's guarding the chest up there. Do you see that? Oh my god, look at all the skeletons. I didn't really, like... I did not drink a night vision potion hoping to see more of you guys, and I don't know where I was shooting that arrow. War <laughs> it was a warning shot. Off their, uh, bow side. There, 
is nothing worth anything in there. Wow, that was just crappy loot. I, I'm never going to get to this guy. Oh, yes, I am, because I'm in one, version 1. 1.4. Before you guys were as annoying as you are. Okay. I see a bunch of redstone in the ceiling. We don't really need that for anything, though. Coal is nice. I really don't care about chain armor. I've got... Yeah, you know what? I've got basically... All the metal armor I want. So I'm not going to worry about chain. Um... Am I looking at him? I kind of hope not. I mean, on the one hand, I want to get his pearl from him, but on the other hand, I don't really feel like stopping to deal with him. So, you know. And we're getting flashing again. What's under the water? That's coal, isn't it? A lot of coal. Wow. Hi, Creeper. Hi. Blink. 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 Oh, you went kaboom. Did I bring ladders? I think I thought about it. I know I thought I should. Apparently a thought was as far as I got with that. Okay, fine. Oh, pillar. Why not? Oh, hell, there's a labeled chest right underneath us. Ah! Ah, hi. Nothing over there. Um. Ooh, now that I will take. Um, blocks I guess I'll take. I really want to break this. Uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter if I do. Stuff will, like one thing will go into my pocket. Okay, this is going to suck for you guys to see it. I am sorry. Um, diving helmet. Thanks so much, Vex. Right. Terrific. Here, you can have that and that and that and that. Um, go ahead and take those. I really don't need... I don't care about that. I can come back and get it if that one or those two pieces of armor is going to make any kind of a difference. Swim up. Up, up, up. Uppity, up, up, up. Whoa, hello. Goodbye. Blink, blink, blink. Blink, blink. Sorry, that's got to be annoying. This is driving me nuts, you guys. Jeez. Look at, they're up on these. So many of these. Ah. Uh, that looks like a labeled chest right there. This water is right at the edge of the damn void fog. Okay, so there, there's a labeled loot chest right there. Oh, wait. No. This torch is right there. Hi, you came and found me all the way over here. I'm so proud. Well, I guess let's go see what that is. There's torches just off to the side of it, but as far as I can tell, we haven't been to it. I have no idea. It's the night vision potion. It's got me all screwed up. I like night vision a lot, but combat supplies low. I don't really need any of it, really, but thank you. It's darn tootin' of ya. How about if you die? I'll put torches around the chest. That way if I see the chest from across the room, at least I can kind of figure out I got it. This still has the sand on top, so we'll go check this out. This is going to take me a minute. I don't know where the fleecy box is going to be, so how hard it's going to be to... Another diving helmet. Okay, maybe all of these things underwater are diving helmets. Oh my god, I can't see a thing. Jeez. I hate that. I hate how the water is. It's so miserable. Okay, there we go. And so I think I'm going to assume that the labeled uh, loot chests underwater are um, diving helmets. That seems to be uh, what I'm seeing anyway. 
Admittedly, we've only found two, but both of them were, so. Okay, so we need to go over there. Uh... Oh, right, and there was that platform with a labeled chest on it, remember? Did I look at you? I don't know, but I'm fixing to be in the water, so it doesn't really matter, because you know what? Y'all can kiss my tushy. I think that's where we came in at. Over there. I don't believe I forgot ladders. I was going to bring ladders. I remember specifically thinking, yep, I should bring ladders. Mm. Dang it. I've got a bunch of junk. In my pocket. So. I think we came in up there, right? I think. So let's go. I am so glad I didn't manage to hit that very edge as I went down past it. I would have felt so ridiculous. So let's come back over here real quick. And uh, see about emptying our pockets a little bit. And then... Is this where I came in? Yeah, it looks like it up there. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Sheesh. At least I remembered. Yes, 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 yes. Cool. I needed to empty out the pockets. So let's empty out the pockets. Um, sign could be handy. We'll keep our sign with us. Hopefully I don't manage to place it anywhere. Wooden axe, that's just what we need. That will solve all of our problems. I like how there's a creeper chilling in the redstone. Ah, uh, our night vision is wearing off. Crap. That looks so cool. Oh my gosh. Huh. I don't know why, but I really like that. I hope it looks as halfway as good on YouTube as it does on my screen. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pause, and I guess I'm going to go get another night vision potion. So stay tuned, and I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, we're back. This is our little base that I set up here at the intersection right here. And the wool is back at the thing, so that's good. So let's go ahead and grab another... Oh, wait, we got them in our pocket already. Okay, cool. I got some more night vision potions for us, so that'll help us a lot in Spine Forest. So let's get back down in there real quick for the last few minutes that we have left of this video, and let's see what we can do. Bonk, 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 bonk. <clears throat> We're back. And I mean, this looks amazing. It really does. I really wish it looked as good on video as it does uh, on my screen right now. But it doesn't, so... Before we use the night vision potion, let's take a look. It looks like we've gone to right about there. Just kind of stop and look around for our light... Ow. The various light cues. Uh, before we lose them. That is one problem with the night vision potions. It renders like you can't really tell. Once I drink this, I can't see that delineation anymore. Where I've been, where we clearly haven't been. Um, but that's okay. Now, I was trying to decide whether or not to make a boat to get through here. Blink, 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 blink. Uh, sorry, it's, it's mesmerizing. I can't help it, you guys. Um, but yeah, whether or not I wanted to make a boat. I thought about it. it uh, boats in this version are such a pain in the ass. Like, I can't. I usually end up crashing the things. We need to go down there and see what that is down there. And we need to go up there. Ow. Oh. Oh, I repaired our gear. And for anybody who didn't know, you repair chain with uh, iron ingots. So, spent a little bit of time at the grinder and repaired our gear. 
I hope this sword holds out. I didn't grab another one. This isn't a real heavy combat area. It's just mostly navigating high bat right in my face. Anyway, this is mostly about navigating around the water and stuff. Whoa! All right, cool. We're down in a hole. Where are you? You're down in a hole. Now you're dead. See how that works? You did not really want to fall down in that hole, did you? Too bad. Should have thought of that before. Oh, you have a glowy bow. Ow! Okay, me. Whoa! Almost placed that sign right there, you guys. There's a zombie, like, right on top of me. Hi. And there's a skeleton. What did I just say about this not being a real heavy combat area? <laughs> Didn't I just say something about that? Because I thought I just said something about that. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe it was just me. It wasn't. I mean, I know I fought a lot of monsters last episode. It's, it's, uh, there's a lot of water in here. So any dark areas are going to be very full of spawns. That's just how it works. Um, actually, come to think of it, this could be nasty. Simply, planar warp could be really bad. Ooh. Yuck. I might want to make a honey pot because... Um, grave of, or, yeah, grave of the dragon or whatever, that was mostly lava. Um, this is mostly water, which means when we're done exploring this, any dark areas in planar warp are going to be max spawn immediately. So I think what I might do, uh, sorry, I got distracted by the level up. What I might do do is uh i might go into grave of the dragon and put the uh turn the lava to obsidian and make it dark in there um and then let things spawn usually one way i like to make a honey pot is to find areas that are lava like that splash them down with water turn them to obsidian um and it's just an easy way to create you know a quick honey pot so that's what I like to do. Something is tickling my knee, and I'm paranoid it's a spider. Because I can't see my knee. It's under my desk. It's not the creepers. They're not tickling. How did none of them just blow up? Like, that was... That was... I have to say, you guys, that was slick. Um, there's sand above us. Yeah, that looks like a update. Oh, crap. Don't land on me. Ow! Thanks. Zombie's like, here, let me get you out from under there. Thanks, zombie. You're a pal. Did I go buy a chest? Was there a chest back there that I didn't get? I don't remember. I'm, I'm like, just kind of fixated on... I'm just fighting monsters, you guys. I don't know if you can tell. I'm totally in the zone. I don't even know if my commentary... I don't even know. Like, I'm just cruising. But our sword's about to break. I haven't even used a fire resist potion because... Or, ah! I got night vision potion. Because I haven't really needed it. I haven't been out in the water. I've been up here on the land. Um, just cruising along. Having a good time. This feels very, uh, very classic super hostile. You know, I'm... We're navigating around and we're putting torches down and we're fighting the spawns and... Yeah. <laughs> It's, this is fun gameplay. I like this. I can do this. But I just realized I'm like totally just kind of spacing. Just da da da. I'm having fun. What can I say, you guys? I'm playing the map. Hi, Creeper. Are you playing the map? I will never look at Creepers the same way since that one scared the shit out of me, though. Looking through that window. My God, that gave me just the creeps. I don't... Like, okay, there was one time I was playing Minecraft, and I wasn't a brand new Minecraft player, but I hadn't been playing for very long. I want to say it was like the second map I started. Um, because I started one map and did it, you know, died a bunch and everything. And then I started another map that I played for longer, you know, because I had figured out some of the game. Anyway, so it was in that map and I was down in a cave and I was fairly lost, you know, of course, me being me. I was lost and I was wandering around and deep in this cave and I don't remember why I couldn't tell you guys what happened I got seriously spooked like there was an enderman down there or I don't even like I can't even like looking back I can't tell I can't say why I got legit spooked down in that cave you guys it was like oh my god seriously 
Like I was jumping at shadows and everything. It was ridiculous. And that was kind of what that creeper face in the window reminded me of was just that that moment of, you know, whether it makes sense or not, it spooked me, you know. In a fun way, of course. Made me laugh. I decided on a boat, by the way. We're getting we we came over here to get a sword and a boat. Shit, I'm probably out of time. But I don't want to be out of time. I'm having fun. Crap. I hate when that happens. Well, let's get back in there and put a boat down at least. But yeah, I think I was at like 17 minutes. And then I cut. Yeah, that'd be about right because I used two night vision potions. So I'm not going to use one now because um, we're probably pretty close to out of time. But I think what I'll go ahead and do, let's go ahead and keep working our way around the edge over here. Like we were doing. And then in the next episode, we'll take a boat. And uh, you know what? I don't feel like screwing with you. We'll take a boat and we'll go. Oh, hi. Uh, we'll go explore the water part of the area. I think that's what we'll do. I'm hoping that the boat gets rid of that blinking. Because we won't be bobbing. But uh, I don't know. Like I've never paid that much attention to it. So we'll just keep working our way around this uh, this edge right here. So that the dark islands in the middle will get really, really full of spawns because they'll be, you know, surrounded by light. See, that's, that's, that's how you do it. That's how you, you know, you up the challenge of a map, up the difficulty of a map, is uh, concentrate the darkness so that monsters concentrate there as well. Yeah. Although it's good to understand the mechanics, um, you're gonna update. No, you didn't. How did you not update anything? Uh, like I can look back the first time I played Spellbound Caves, which was the first map I ever played. Um, whoops. I can look back and I can see things that I did wrong. Like I lit up all the darkness, you know, in every, every level I went into, I lit up all the darkness. So. Yeah, look at all those monsters on that island. That's going to be a battle to get onto. Actually, I have a plan. So. We'll put that into play next episode. But I do have a plan. Oh, hi, creepers. You guys aren't going to wait till next episode. You're going to have to be dealt with a little sooner than that. Just a little bit. There's one right behind me. Blow up! Thank you, God! What the hell was that? Lag? I was like, okay, I got one in front of me and one behind me. One of them's blowing up. I'm just going to block. Let my armor absorb the damage. And then he took forever to blow up. And I'm using a smite. I grabbed our other smite four swords. We had two smite four swords. And I'm using the other one. So it doesn't do great against spiders or creepers. But it does have knockback at least. Oh my god, the skeletons. Ugh. Oh, hi. Go away. I'm going to skeleton rage in a minute. I swear it. We have a good bow. I should be using my bow more. We have infinity. Holy crap. Well, I am concentrating the dark areas. Go away. Really? I think I just bounced him onto a ledge over there so that he can, you know, make a third try at getting to us. Oh, well. Three tries, three fails. It's all good. Ow. Whoops. I'm in a hole. Oh, there's a creeper. Tut. There's block. I'm actually surprised we're not taking more damage than we are. I think we must have blast protection. Do we? Oh, yep, we do. Cool. That's why creeper bombs are being so effective. Because we have blast protection. Okay, you know what? I I really probably should go. God, this episode's going to be an hour long. But I'm having fun. I don't want to. Die. Oh dear. Yeah, we got skeletons everywhere. 
This is my little island. You can't have it. Ah! Um, <clears throat> that tickled. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Whoops. I'm determined to place that sign. Apparently, I keep trying. I look. I'm trying to take the island so I can sign off. You know, like hey, okay, got a safe spot to sign off from, but no. You guys are being knuckleheads. Go away. Um, yeah, I gotta, I, I gotta go. But, uh, in the next episode, we are going to employ my methods for, uh, taking that central island right there. And we'll also continue working our way around this edge and stuff. We'll do stuff. It'll be great. Stay tuned. Everybody take care. Thanks for watching. Bye now. Look at all those points. Mm.